Do you know what we got this stuff for? Do you remember? Mm -hmm. Where are we going? up to the Colleen Conference and Civic Center because there is a vegan convention going on. It's called the Veg Veggie and Arts Fest. I'm um, here with my mom and my dad. For some samples. And where's Zaya? Zaya? So we just walked in, we're about to check in, I guess. See what this is like. Zaya insisted on wearing winter gloves today. <laughs> an indoor thing and it's not even cold outside really. Okay. Everybody was surprised when he got up on stage. Are you enjoying the show? <laughs> Vegan cinnamon roll. Good. Good? Papa tried some vegan gumbo. Tastes like soup. <laughs> trying to understand vegan meals, vegan ingredients. So this was interesting. We're about to head out. We just came because my cousin, my second cousin, she was helping it on and she was a part of it. So we came to support her. And then also Tabitha Brown was like the celebrity guest and she was doing a meet and greet. And my mom really wanted to meet her. So we did that. And we walked around the booths just to kind of see all of the small businesses, the vegan and plant-based small businesses. And they have some cool stuff in there. Unfortunately, when it came time for us to actually like order food, the power went out. So all of the chefs were not able to finish cooking their food so we didn't really get to actually taste any actual food but and we just came out to show support so okay <laughs> so we're at this venezuelan restaurant now since the veggie fest ran out of food <laughs> mommy was disappointed so we got some fresh juice um passion fruit and some plantains Plantains, because y'all hate when I say plantains. So correct me in the comments if I'm wrong, but I believe that this is a arepa. It is called the llanera, and it is steak and avocado and sauce. I got it with no cheese, of course, but normally it would have cheese on it. Looks good. Same thing. Same thing, but with the cheese on it. So that's what it fully looks like. And then also some, is it beef empanadas? Yeah, like cornbread with beef. Yeah. We interrupt this mom vlog to bring you a word from our sponsor. No, but really you guys, you know if you watch my videos that I love using HelloFresh to cut back on the stress and the planning and the grocery shopping for dinner time. If you guys don't know, HelloFresh is a meal kit delivery service where you get all your ingredients delivered right to your door in this refrigerated box. So you get the exact quantities of all the ingredients that you need for your meals and it comes with instructions that have pictures so it makes it super easy to follow along and whip up these meals really quickly. You don't have to be a master chef to be able to prepare them. So I like to normally do these with Zaya and have her help me cook them as like a fun little activity to spice up dinner time. But it also really comes in clutch for me to whip up something really quick while she's taking a nap. There are over 22 seasonal chef curated recipes to choose from each week and there's something for everyone. One. They have low calorie, vegetarian, and family friendly options. And personally, I really like the fact that since they give you the exact quantities of the ingredients that you need for the meals, that means that there's less food waste. And the packaging that HelloFresh uses is almost entirely made from recyclable materials or already recycled content. Plus, HelloFresh is really flexible, so you don't have to worry about being locked into a certain thing. You can always add extra meals to your weekly order, throw in extra sides or desserts, and you can easily change your delivery days or your 
your food preferences. So if you guys want to try it out, all you have to do is go to HelloFresh.com and use my code RavenElise10 for 10 free meals, including free shipping. You guys know I always have the hookup for you guys. So again, that's RavenElise10 for 10 free meals, including free shipping. Now let's get back to the mom blog. Okay, so we had our little family fun day this morning, um, but now we have dropped Papa off back at their house so he can do his little Saturday morning, Saturday activities, I guess, whatever he's gonna do. And now my mom and Zaya and I are heading to a special store to buy some special supplies for a special adventure that Zaya does not know about yet. Do you know where we're going? We're going to a special store right now because we are going to be purchasing uh, maybe a big winter coat, maybe some boots, maybe a hat and some gloves. You already have gloves, but we need like real gloves, like thicker gloves. And so why do you think we might need that type of clothes? Where do you think we're going? You think we're going to the beach? No. You think we're going to the zoo? No. What kind of place do you have to wear a jacket and boots and gloves? Snow. Yeah. We're going to somewhere with lots of snow. Do you want to do that? Have you ever seen lots of snow before outside? In real life? Like on the tree. It'll sometimes like snow like a tiny bit, just barely enough to cover the ground where we live, obviously, in Central Texas, but she has never seen like actual snow that you can play in and build a snowman type thing. So this will be her first time, and this is going to be the first installment of a new series that I'm starting on my channel. Um, I don't wanna give too much away right now, but I do wanna let you guys know that it is, it is going to be its own separate series, and it is going to be a lot of fun because this is just the first trip of many, first adventure of many. I plan on meeting new people, seeing new things, and doing new things, and just exposing Zaya to a lot of fun things that you know, kids don't always get a chance to do. You want to make a snowman? You can make for the arm sticks, and you can make for the mouth, and the nose. Wow. And you use pine, you know, raisins for the mouth. Do we need to pack carrots and raisins for the snowman? Should we put that in the suitcase? And sticks? <laughs> well, they probably have sticks there. We're going to do lots of fun things in the snow. I'm going to tell you more about it before we go. It's funny because Zaya is insisting on wearing her gloves today. That's her random three-year-old thing right now. Little did she know, we're actually going to buy snow gear and gloves. So you should love this since you're obsessed with gloves right now. <laughs> like you're gonna do something illegal. So we just pulled up to Sail and Ski. They sell boating stuff, but they also sell snow-related gear, snowboarding, skiing, all that stuff. So hopefully this is probably one of the main areas in town that you can actually get actual snow gear aside from just ordering stuff online. Cause I wanted Zai to be able to try it on. Ooh. Well that goes under or over your jacket. What color outfit do you want to get? Pink. Wow, Zaya. It's very pretty. It's got um, porcupines on it. more about this series. The idea behind it is new people, places, and things. I wanna take this time while Zaya is, you know, little but kind of old enough to learn and, and enjoy things. And she hasn't started real school yet, so we have more flexibility in 
I have tons of flexibility in my schedule, but she still has flexibility in her schedule because she's not in regular school yet. So we can take basically this whole year to travel and explore and do things. And that way, by the time she gets older, she can have these experiences under her belt and say that she's seen and done these things. And I just think it can be really educational, obviously really fun and really um, just kind of be a, a growth opportunity for her. It can help with maybe some anxieties that she might have, help with her getting more social. You learn new things, you meet new people. Okay, so I am going to need a little snow outfit as well because I have not been skiing or anything since I was like a teenager. I don't even know where my old snowsuit is. I probably can't fit it. So I'm gonna get a new set. I'm gonna get pants and a coat and probably gloves and a hat and all types of stuff. I'm probably just gonna get black pants. They luckily have a long section, which is good, petite and long. These are more of the straight legs. Some of the other ones look like straight up bell bottoms, which I'm not into, <laughs> but these are more straight, so that's good. I mean, it's not really meant to be cute, so. Ooh, girl, what? This stuff is expensive. Okay, so here is the size four long on me, which I'm glad they come in long because these fit nicely. The regular ones would have looked kind of high water, especially with my boots on. I feel like I would have looked, I don't know. I like the long length. The back has this like high back thing, I guess, so that when you, if you fall or anything, the snow doesn't go down your pants. But it's like, it's loose. It's like really loose. <laughs> I think the, the things don't reach. It's like, well, just don't even try those on. Just see if those are any longer than those. And I like the idea of having more like a snow legging rather than the big snow pants. And these are also cheaper. They're about 49 compared to 255. And they're just more my speed. So we're gonna have to order some stuff online. My mom already found some on Zappos that Zaya says she likes because of course they're pink. Little snow boots. We gotta get snow boots, snow pants, snow jackets, snow gloves, snow hat, snow shirt, snow underwear. There's the pants. The little overalls, but she, she wants light pink and they have light pink. She wants this one with the flowers on it. So yeah, we pretty much have to order all her stuff online because they don't have her sizes here in the store. Now we're at Academy. Academy Sports and Outdoors. I was thinking just like a simple North Face jacket. I'm not familiar with the different style names and whatever because I've never had a North Face, but I feel like that'll be a good classic winter coat. I guess Columbia is another good brand, but these are very ugly, so. You want a Minnie Mouse hat, Taya? And the matching gloves. How about a fox? You like that hat? No. No? Uh -uh. <laughs> no licensed characters. No. That's my rule. Okay, so that was a fail. Academy really didn't have barely no cold weather stuff in there at all. Um, so I think we're probably gonna check Dick's Sporting Goods as like the last in-store place and then from there we'll just have to get everything online which is what I was expecting anyway and that's fine. Okay, now we're at Dick's Sporting Goods. Y'all know how the vlogs go. We gotta go to 40 million stores just to barely buy one thing. <laughs> Hopefully they have better selection here. I think they should. It's hard shopping for stuff and preparing for stuff when you're not really like an expert on it. I mean, my how many times have you gone to the snow, mommy, would you say? Eight. My mom has gone at several times, like eight or nine times. So she has a little bit of knowledge. I've gone like three times maybe, but not recently. Like I want like the cute North Face stuff like this. Look, this jacket, but I don't want red. Is this kid size? I could probably low key fit a kid size though. The kiddo mittens. Did you miss the kitty all day? We've been going all day doing stuff since 10 o'clock this morning. Poor kitty been home by himself, but he's okay. Did you miss him? Mm -hmm. 
need to get down and walk on something. He means he needs to walk on the floor so he can play with his stuff and go out and go in the Sweet kitty boy. Kitty boy. So anyway, obviously we are home now. We literally did not buy a single thing <laughs> from all three stores we just went to, literally purchased nothing. But we did get to try things on, see what we like, what we don't like, and we definitely have um, an idea. I already know exactly what all I'm gonna get for Zaya, and I'm pretty sure I know what I'm gonna get for myself. I just have to order the stuff online because they did not have our size or the color we wanted in literally anything that we saw. So this was a very unsuccessful shopping day, but I'll just order everything online. That way we'll be ready for the trip. And of course, like I said, I'm gonna be doing a whole series about this. So you guys are gonna get to see all of our adventures. This is just the first of many. I have a lot of different things and places um, that I plan on taking Zaya with me to explore, so it should be really fun. Hopefully this first trip goes well. Are you excited? What kind of things are you hoping to do when we go to the snow? Mm, I'm gonna put on my winter stuff and I'm gonna read every single snack, but I'm kinda hungry on this winter day. You get hungry on a winter day? Mm -hmm. And what kind of things should we eat? When we're there, we just eat maybe fruit snacks. And what else? Maybe. Oh, we can eat some. Maybe something that we can. Maybe they'll have a fire, and then what can we make with the fire? Mm -hmm. More. Yeah. <laughs> and what kind of things do you do in the snow? And make a snowman jump down. What's that called? Um, that's how you make something beautiful. Something beautiful? It's called a snow angel. <laughs> and we're gonna go sledding, and I think we're gonna go up to the mountains and see the mountains, and we're gonna do a lot of fun stuff. There's a lot of stuff you can do in the snow. Yeah. Things that you've never done before, so we're gonna try new things. Are you excited to try new things? Mm -hmm. When it's time to try new things, are you gonna be brave? Or are you gonna be scared? Brave. Brave. First I was making the snow a snowman. Mm-hmm. Yeah, we'll definitely do that. But they're gonna do some some new things that you may not have heard of and you have to be brave and you have to be open to it and just try it and see if you like it, right? <laughs> okay guys, so it is a few days later and we've got some of our stuff in from ordering it. So since they didn't have the size and the color I wanted, I had to make a separate order. So this is my North Face. Wow, first North Face, kinda nervous. I got the long one that I tried on in the store in black, something simple, classy that I can like wear on my future New York trips and stuff too, like not just for the snow. So I think it fits really well. What? I see the kitty. So this will be something that I can get a lot of use out of and wear it like when I go to other cold places like when I go to New York and stuff. So I think it'll be nice and versatile. I'll get some use out of it. Fits well, sleeves fit well. I like it. Wow, look at me making an investment in a nice North Face coat. I still need to get my pants I need to order and probably some actual snow boots and just a few little things like socks and gloves, which should be pretty easy to order off of Amazon, so I'm not too worried about that. Of course, I'm also gonna be just like packing regular long sleeve shirts and leggings and whatnot, but this was like really the main thing. And then, Zaya. Yes, and yes, and. Wow. So you guys can see what color scheme Zaya is going for. So this is the size four. <laughs> snowsuit outfit. The light pink snowsuit pants thingies. You like it? Is that the color you wanted? Pink. What is it? It's my jacket with roses on there. Yeah, you wanna open it? Yeah. Here. Wow, a nice real winter coat for the snow. With a background. 
Mm-hmm. You wanna try it on and see if it fits? Yeah, and the guy at the store was telling me that this brand actually has like some extender thing built in, so hopefully she'll be able to wear it for a couple years because you can like extend the sleeves. <laughs> you like it? Do you know what we got this stuff for? Do you remember? Mm -hmm. Where are we going? I don't know. You forgot? Where did I tell you we're going and why we need all this stuff? Yes, we're going to the snow. Mommy told me a video about that. Grammy showed you a video about it? Mm -hmm. Yeah, we're trying to get you hyped up so you know what to expect, so you'll be excited. But I don't want to go ski down the mountain. I want to make a snowman. We don't have to go skiing down the mountain. We're going to take baby steps and make sure that you're comfortable, but we want you to try new things. So yeah, Zaya's got her snowsuit pants the jacket to go with it, and the pink boots. Super legit. She's gonna look like a little, I don't know, a little pink marshmallow with all her gear on, and we have to get her a hat and some gloves. So yeah, I'm feeling a lot more prepared. The trip is coming up really soon. Are you excited? Me and Grandma are gonna make a snowman, and you are gonna make a snowman by your own. Oh, why do I have to do it by myself? Because for Yes, Grammy and me are gonna make a snowman together. Okay. Are you excited for the trip or nervous? Nervous. 